Hey everybody, welcome back to VO Essentials. Breaking news about Apple using some controllers by HTC, the HTC ones, to test out its Apple Vision Pro. Big news, what does it mean? Let's go through all the news, guys. Now, before we actually go to the Apple reportedly tested HTC controllers for VR, but no plans for future controllers yet, do remember that the Apple Vision Pro will support dual sense controllers and over a hundred apple arcade games which basically means that you'll be able to play your games in a vr mixed reality setting to make you feel like you're immersed within vr like a bit like virtual desktop i guess where you can play all your pc vr games within a vr immersive virtual environment could be an office could be a cinema could be on a planet mars could be wherever and then you have a giant screen there and you know you use a controller to basically be immersed within that environment and then play your games now however i have to say that you know there seem to be some little issues here and there especially with developers saying that why are apple you know if we go back to the article uh you know apple are reportedly only on labeling people to have an immersive experience within 1.5 meters of diameter within the bubble. Now we know that when we play VR or we walk around or we move around in VR, you know, 1.5 meters is really not that big of a space and it's very easy to get out of VR and to break the immersion. So hopefully Apple will fix this. And very sorry for any background noise, they seem to be doing some streaming or something or rather. But let's go back into the actual article, guys. So this is about the 100 Apple Arcade games. And as I mentioned, you'll be able to basically uh, link up, you know, like the PS5 controller and also a whole bunch of other controllers. No names so far about the actual games that will be playable, but we do know that the NBA 2K23 Arcade Edition is currently the only title that has been outright confirmed for the headset. And of course, hopefully there will be more. So let's go back to the actual article about the HTC controllers, which could potentially be huge news, guys. Apple has tested the HTC controllers for their Vision Pro headset, but has stated that they are not actively planning controllers for their own devices. Now, potentially also, as we know, you know, Apple will maybe, this is a hint, that they will actually do provide controllers so that people can have a really good gaming experience and, you know, spatial computing for doing your everyday tasks with your hands and things. Okay, fine, but you know, to do some games, you really do need controllers. And I think perhaps, perhaps, perhaps it's a marketing ploy, you know, to do basically, you know, to generate more revenue so they could sell the controllers as an accessory. And then of course, accessorize the controllers as well. Why not? And I will talk about accessories and stuff in a future video. So do hit the notification bell after you subscribe and the likes to let me know that you like these kind of breaking news stories in the vr industry all right let's go back to the actual article and again very sorry about the news the news sorry the noise outside which is why i'm talking a bit louder to make sure you can actually hear me it has always it has almost been a month since apple vision pro officially announced one major aspect that was leaked before the announcement and caused concerns it how is how the company plans to handle the input system while most current vr ar devices prioritize handheld controllers for input with some also including hand tracking and occasional eye tracking, Apple has taken a different approach as we all know guys. And also of course, Meta are the kings of hand tracking at this moment in time, even though with the Pico 4, this one here, you can also use hand tracking natively inside of the Pico as well. All right, let's get back to the article. However, this has led to confusion amongst VR players without motion controllers. The majority of currently available VR games are incompatible with Apple Vision's Pro headset. This raises numerous questions about whether or when company will release motion controllers for VR gaming. According to Mark Gunman, a reliable analyst at Apple, the company has made the decision to not develop any third-party game controllers for VR and has no plans to support this uh, to support third-party VR accessories. However, if you go to watch the video that I did yesterday about uh, the, the creator of one of the Windows drivers to be able to make the PS VR 2 compatible with a PC VR headset, we do know that it is possible. There are minds that are absolutely mind-boggling out there, amazing talent that could most undoubtedly, hopefully, make some controllers 
compatible, of course, with the Apple Vision Pro. All right, let's go back to the article, everybody, uh, to see if we can find any other nuggets. As reported, Apple has taken the opportunity to thoroughly examine the industry standards for VR, which for the past eight years resolved around controllers. The, con the company reported ran test third-party VR controllers, including those of HTC, everybody. However, after careful consideration, the ultimate uh, made the decision they ultimately made the decision, excuse me, to fully embrace eye tracking, eye and hand tracking as a more elegant and refined solution. German also mentioned that the company explored alternative ideas for VR inputs such as finger-worn devices, perhaps patented rings. Yes, that's very true. That could function as controllers or enhance hand tracking with haptic feedback. However, these concepts did not make it into the final version of this device, likely due to the inconvenience users would have faced in having to put on rings on their fingers while vision pro won't include any motion controllers this isn't the end of the world it appears that certain vr games and experiences will be compatible with vision os shortly now we do know that rec room which is one of the most popular social vr games at the moment we can go and basically meet a ton of people inside of the metaverse they have so many mini games inside including the fact that you can do some shooting games paintballing games adventure games running games basketball games i mean a hand handball games whole bunch of different mini games inside a rec room and of course it's all going to be using apparently finger tracking so that's going to be very 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 interesting all right guys well there you have it this is the news what does it mean do you think that you know you would want i mean would you want to actually have controllers with the vision pro leave a comment below love to get your thoughts on this what do you think of this news the fact that they use the htc ones do you think it secretly means that they are actually gearing towards launching potentially some controllers or do you think this is just another pr gimmick to get people to keep talking about the apple vision pro until its release we don't know we don't have a clue leave a comment below but all in all it's really good to see apple in the news with meta there i have to admit so meta are not taking all the news there as we can see all right see you in another video remember to smash the like so let me know if you like these kind of breaking news videos the notification bell off to you subscribe so you get notified of all these breaking time sensitive uh, videos as well as of course amas that we do as live streams that we just did very recently with the founder and creator of walkabout mini golf that was awesome to so do go and check out that video after this video see you later guys bye for now